The Uplink 79 message, or UM79 for short, is a widely used CPDLC uplink message across the world. It is used in both FANS and ATN airspace. There have been some recent reports that this message has been subject to misunderstanding by flight crews. This quick topic video will demonstrate how to properly handle a UM79 should one be sent to your aircraft. The UM79 has the form of clear to some waypoint via route clearance. The example we'll explore is one where the UM79 states cleared to Bucko via route clearance. Graphically, that looks like this, where Bucko is a waypoint name already on our existing flight plan, and there is at least one waypoint ATC wants us to fly to on our way to Bucko. Notice that this is not the same as proceeding direct to Bucko. If ATC wanted us to proceed direct to Bucko, the uplink message would have been a UM74 and looked like this it would have said proceed direct to Bucko. You can see that clearly these are two distinct different messages in ATC instructions. Now that we understand that a UM79 is not a direct to clearance, but rather a partial reroute, let's explore this route clearance element of the message. The route clearance element of the message is really just a placeholder for the waypoints and routing that ATC wants you to fly to on your way to Bucko. So how do we view these waypoints? On the Honeywell Epic and NG FMS, advance to the last page of the message and select the ATC clearance prompt to view the waypoints and routing contained in the route clearance element. This particular clearance is an instruction to proceed direct to Tanner, then Croin, then Bucko, then rest of route unchanged. To load this clearance into the active flight plan, return back to the ATC uplink message and select the Apply prompt on the last page of the message. This creates a modified flight plan with the new routing to Bucko. However, do not activate the change just yet. Accept the clearance and send the Wilco response. After the message status changes to Accepted, activate the modified flight plan.